Some time ago, while I was visiting the island of Trinidad, I saw a very remarkable Hindu magician. He had a silk handkerchief. He took the silk handkerchief and he made a single knot and he held it in his hand. Then he looked at it, rather mysterious look, the handkerchief almost seemed to become alive. Would you be kind enough to act as my assistant for just a few minutes? Of course. I'm going to attempt something a little different, something which I rather think you may enjoy. Now, this little effect was invented by a friend of mine who happens to be a gentleman farmer. Would you mind holding the hat for just a minute? I'm, in just a moment, I'm going to place the hat on the top of the glass, and then I want you to watch very carefully and keep your eye right on the hat. Oh, and, the, <laughs> and the glass inside the hat. Well, now that's the first part, but now I'm going to attempt the second part, which is a little different. We'll take this pitcher of ordinary milk, which you can see. As you see, the uh, milk will now fill the glass, and we will again cover the glass with the silk. Many times magicians are always asked why they happen to do things undercover, but we have to sometimes. So one, two, three, and the glass and milk disappear. Now, you're probably wondering where the milk went. Well, we'll take this little bag, There we find the missing milk. <laughs> Thank you very much. Now I'd like to show you my latest very colorful novelty, The Rice Bowls of Fu Manchu. mind if I do a little magic? You? Why, of course not. <laughs> Go right ahead. Thank you. Take a bowl, fill it with tomato soup, and you have the basis for a quick, appetizing, and nutritious lunch. Mmm, good. And that's only one on the list of America's favorite lunches. Another is to combine this rich, tasteful soup with an appetizing sandwich. Or you might prefer a luncheon of soup, salad, and dessert. But maybe that's a little too much, or perhaps you're in a hurry. Well then, let's just make it soup and dessert. You see, with good, rich Campbell soup as your starting point, there are so many combinations available. But according to a nationwide survey, the most popular is, that's right, soup, sandwich, and dessert. I don't know about the rest of the country, but it's certainly the most popular with me. But where in the world did you... Oh, I'm not finished yet. In fact, I've just begun. Now let's take that situation when unexpected company comes. Build that quick buffet supper around a tureen. Then fill with chicken noodle soup. And you have the heart of a meal that makes you glad guests dropped in. Well, I thought I knew every magic trick there was. <laughs> well, maybe you do. But this is a different kind of magic. This is mealtime magic built around soup. Soup is wonderful for lunch, a quick snack, or light meals. But soup is more than soup. It adds flavor to your meals. 
It lends color to your table. It's a time-saving ingredient in quick cookery. It's an ideal, convenient sauce for many dishes. It's... But let me show you. Tomato soup went into the making of this delicious beef stew. Here's a casserole dish and mushroom muffins, both made with cream of mushroom soup. Now, watch this one. Just look at the possibilities with tomato soup. Mmm, good. Mmm, wonderful. But how do you do it? With know-how? And the right equipment? And a full soup shelf. Of course. Why didn't I think of it? Campbell's Soups. Yes. Here in our home economics kitchen, we keep a complete soup shelf and work just as women do in their own home kitchens. When you keep a well-stocked soup shelf based on your family's needs, you have the foundation for an endless variety of delicious meals. Wait a minute. You're holding out on me. Do you mean that's all there is to it? A Campbell's Soup Shelf? A Campbell's Soup Shelf. Plus ideas. You see, women everywhere are constantly discovering new uses for soup. And in my work as Campbell's Home Economist, it's my job to create new ways in which soup can serve you even better. So get ready for some real mealtime magic. Remember, there are over 20 tempting, nourishing mealtime soups. And that's only the beginning. Soup combinations, soup sauces, and soup as a cooking ingredient suggest a thousand and one quick, easy menu variations. Many women have told us they think Campbell's tomato soup, just as it comes from the can, makes the finest tomato cooking sauce they ever tasted. You haven't begun to realize how useful tomato soup can be until you've used it as a cooking sauce. You'll find it's just about the handiest thing on your kitchen shelf. For instance, You can use it just as it comes from the can, as a pour-on sauce over meat, fish, or vegetables. Simply season to taste, and heat. It's just the right consistency for a rich, smooth textured sauce. See, it adds zip and color to beef, pork, and fish. Do you like Spanish sauce? Well, try it made with tomato soup. It's the quick, easy way to make Spanish rice and Spanish omelet. It adds the zest of the world's finest tomatoes, carefully blended seasonings, and creamery butter. And as the basic ingredient in barbecue sauce, there's nothing to equal the fresh, zestful flavor of tomato soup. Here's something I particularly like. Cream of mushroom soup for a delicate, flavorful mushroom cream sauce. Add a third of a cup of milk for mushroom cream sauce. And simmer about two minutes. And remember to stir the sauce constantly for best results. This is a real five-minute mushroom cream sauce. Rich, delicious, and velvet smooth. You can taste those fresh, cultivated mushrooms and whipping cream. Try it, and you'll never again make white sauce the old, slow way. This sauce is good on meat, vegetables, or poultry. Try it on fried chicken for something extra special. Then there's cream of chicken soup for sauce. Over vegetables, it's a delicious economical treat to tempt lagging appetites. 
For cream of chicken sauce, add a third of a cup of milk to the soup. Cream of celery soup sauce is excellent with fish. Use half a cup of milk with cream of celery. This sauce enhances the flavor of ham, too. Condensed soup has limitless possibilities as a tasty, time-saving pour-on sauce. And you don't have to remember the directions. They're on the label. But for the last word in mealtime magic, try soup as a cooking ingredient. Women are using condensed soups more and more in recipes. They're so quick and economical and add so much flavor and color. For example, tomato soup in meatloaf. Use half a can of Campbell's tomato soup in your favorite meatloaf for the rich flavor, color, and moistness you are seeking. Of course, the rest of the soup, heated and seasoned, will make a delicious pour-on sauce to be served with the loaf. And tomato soup is just the thing for a rich, full-flavored spaghetti sauce. Season to suit your family's taste. It shortens the sauce cooking time and is so good. The rich, ripe red color of the choice tomatoes has eye as well as taste appeal. Make new friends of old standbys. Don't forget, tomato cheese macaroni made with tomato soup is a new quick and easy dish that's welcome and amply satisfying at any lunch or supper. There are many other baked dishes made with soup that will make a hit with your family. Let me show you something special. For a tender, light souffle, use cream of chicken soup. Your souffle will hold up longer, too, and taste delicious. Use the cream of chicken soup, just as it comes from the can, in place of the regular cream sauce. Another tempting baked dish made with chicken soup is chicken pie. The extra-rich chicken flavor makes this a favorite with good cooks everywhere. Cream of mushroom soup is another invaluable cooking ingredient. Use it instead of the old-fashioned white sauce in the ever-popular casseroles. The flavor of tuna and mushroom is a made-for-each-other combination. Another quick treat with mushroom soup is mushroom muffins. Use condensed cream of mushroom soup as the liquid in quick breads like these. Here are muffins with a different twist, a subtle new flavor. One way to make an everyday dish taste better. If it's baked goods you like, come over here. You'll be amazed and delighted to know that this cake was made with tomato soup. Your cake will have a spicy, mellow flavor and retain moisture longer when you use condensed tomato soup instead of milk. Soup salads are another quick, easy way to party delicacy. Doesn't this look delicious? The color and flavor of chicken cranberry salad make it a perfect everyday dish or party fare. To make this salad, add unflavored gelatin to cream of chicken soup. Mix thoroughly and pour it into a mold. Then place the chicken layer in the refrigerator until the salad is firm. When the chicken layer is firm, add a cranberry layer to the molded salad for taste and color contrast. Then return it to the refrigerator until ready to serve. The more women try soup salads, the more they use them, for they're easy to make and so good to eat. Soup is a natural way of getting flavor into salads. And have you tried salad dressings made with soup? Just mix oil, vinegar, seasonings, and tomato soup for an excellent French dressing. It's good on vegetable or fruit salad, adds spiciness and color. And the flavor of tomato blends with practically any other flavor. The recipes for the dishes we've made, and many, many more, are in this free recipe booklet. And I'll be very glad to send it to you. Just write to me, Anne Marshall, Campbell Soup Company, for your copy of our newest recipe booklet. If, like everyone else, you're looking for new ways to add variety and interest to your meals, well, here's the answer. This little book, plus your own home soup shelf.
Try equal parts of clam chowder, tomato soup, and milk or water for a hearty, tangy soup that'll satisfy the heartiest appetite. Cream of chicken with cream of asparagus is another delicious combination. And puree mongol, equal parts of tomato, green pea, milk, and water, wins rave notices every time. For a delicious jellied consomme, chill the consomme in the unopened can in the refrigerator for about four hours. Then serve it just as it is. Of course, garnishes and accompaniments make soups even more appealing. The flavor of chicken and parsley are a wonderful twosome. Crisp bacon bits add zest to cream of mushroom. Cheese-flavored snacks go well with many soups. Just let your imagination be your guide. When you're really hungry, there's just nothing like a bowl of steaming hot soup. And do you know why these soups are so good? To find out, let's consult the people who have made soup a career. Here at Campbell's, infinite care and painstaking attention to details go into the preparation of the soups. Soups that put magic in mealtime. There is nothing left to chance. Every ingredient is given a most thorough inspection. Meats and chickens, for example, are double-checked by both company and government inspectors. With the aid of suction tubes that work like tiny vacuum cleaners, fine rice is sorted by hand, grain by grain. Too much trouble? No, not at all because these soups must be of unvarying fine quality. Quality ensured by having much of the food preparation work done just as it is in the finest home kitchens. There is no substitute for good old-fashioned handwork. Yes, each ingredient must truly be from the cream of the nation's crop, superior in color, flavor, texture, and nutritive value. And if the best obtainable is not good enough, something better is developed. For example, the fine tomatoes used in Campbell's tomato soup. Our experimental farms are devoted to the never-ending work of developing better farm practices and finer produce to enhance the flavor and nutritional qualities of the soups. Over 40 years of research have gone into the development of the tomatoes, which are specially grown for Campbell's soups. Many types of soil are tested for fertility. Growers are shown how to improve their soil in order that plants will have the proper soil foods. Promising varieties of tomatoes are crossed with others, then crossed again, until the desired characteristics of firmness, hardiness, high nutritional value, uniform ripening, deep color, delicious flavor are combined in a single fruit. And today, thousands of farmers grow these fine tomatoes for the soup most folks like best. Such developments take almost endless time, extreme patience, and just plain hard work. But it all pays off in better methods of farming and higher yields for the grower, in finer vegetables and better soups for you. Each farmer's load of the finest tomatoes the growers can deliver is carefully graded by government experts for color and smoothness. For Campbell's soups must look as good as they taste. And Campbell's offers farmers a cash incentive to deliver finest tomatoes. Unsurpassed cleanliness, the tomatoes are washed not less than five times, and then inspected one by one. Only the best find their way into Campbell's tomato soup. ingredients, the cream of the crop, handled with skillful attention to every detail to ensure quality and zestful flavor is the secret of this magic in mealtime. Yes, America has become a soup-loving nation.
Today and every day, millions of people eat soup for lunch. Soup and a salad is a favorite luncheon all over the country. Another luncheon favorite is soup and a sandwich. And still another is soup and dessert. But whether it's soup for lunch, soup for baby's first solid food, soup is the family favorite. The party dish, the heart of the meal. It's good for you, and everyone likes soup. For soup helps to make every meal a delightful meal. A feast for the eye, appetizing, delicious. Yes, mmm, good. <laughs>